Almost every nation has its own national wrestling. For example, the Bashkirs, the Tatars and the Chuvash have Kurish belt wrestling. The Japanese are crazy about sumo wrestling. In Yakusha, Kapsagai is successfully developing. The Bariats, who also have their own national wrestling view of Bereldon, are not standing aside. It is very similar to their neighbor's national wrestling, the Mongolian wrestling Bahin Bereldon, but still has some differences. The Bariat National Wrestling Bu Bereldon as a type of martial arts comes from ancient times. There are many legends in Bariat folklore about nimble bogatirs with unprecedented physical strength who fought off enemies, evil spirits, or fought at feasts for the right to possess a bride. This sport of ancestors is in the heart of every Bariat. It beckons with its primitiveness, simplicity, uniqueness and transience, and every bout is unlike any other. Nobody will tell us the exact date of birth of the National Buried Wrestling. We can only appeal to written sources. So for the first time wrestling is mentioned in the book Secret History of Mongols, which was composed in 1140. The next historical date is June 1891. Grand Duke Nikolai Alexandrovich Romanov, the future Emperor Nicholas E, arrived in the Transbaikal region. As the heir to the throne he met with the Ajim Buried on the banks of the River Tura. In honor of Romanov, they organized a holiday in Gurban Nodden, the three games of men. In addition to wrestling Buu Bereldon, participants competed in horse races and archery. The contest was photographed. This is how the first photo of the Buried National Wrestling appeared. Wrestling itself was invented for hand-to-hand -hand combat and self-defense. Some would say that in National Wrestling you can only use a narrow range of moves, unlike in wrestling, but he is wrong. It all depends on the skill of the athlete. As for the outfit of wrestlers, the traditional clothing of the Bu barreled on wrestlers consists of boots, guchula, short shorts, shoe deck, and invariable attribute, beef belt. Before the fight, wrestlers perform the dance of the eagle. This ritual seems to imitate the flight of the mythical bird Garuda, one of the earthly incarnations of Shakyamuni Buddha. As for the rules of the competitions, they are constantly changing. The rule of three points remains unchanged. One should fight till the third point. Any grappling above and below the waist is permitted as well as any other wrestling actions. The winner of the bout is the one who forced his opponent to touch the ground with any part of his body except his feet. Even if he accidentally touches the ground with the third point he is considered to be the loser. Wrestlers are given five minutes for the bout. If after five minutes the winner is not found, the continuation of the fight is decided by a coin toss. A coin is thrown in the air. Whoever gets an eagle, he is given the right to be the first to take the opponent for his belt. If, after another five minutes, a draw is declared, the wrestlers are offered another coin toss. The lucky one is given the right to be the first to take the grip for the belt but behind the back of his opponent. This is the so-called advantageous or deep clinch. Usually the one who made the deep clinch wins the duel. The rules prohibit breaking the grip. At the end of the fight the loser goes under the champion's arm as a sign of respect and the winner in the dance of the eagle in a clockwise direction bypasses the wrestling ground. At this point he is congratulated and praise songs are sung. Now national buried wrestling is rapidly developing, but at the time of the Soviet Union there was a period when wrestling almost lost its flavor. The rule the third point was cancelled. The winner was obliged to put the rival on his blades. It came to that decision of the Freestyle Wrestling Federation of Buryatia 1960 for the belt was taken off the traditional attributes, and wrestling began to be almost by the rules of wrestling. They came back to their roots in the early 90s of the last century. Nowadays tournaments held by the traditional Buddhist Sangha of Russia gather over a thousand people from all over Buryatia. Love for Bu Bereldon pushes even boundaries. Guests from Tuva, Yakusha, Kakassia. The Altai territory in Mongolia come to the Republican competitions. And when the strong men come out into the ring, the blood boils in their veins. It is not clear at whom emotions flare up more, at those who come together in tough fights, fighters, or at those who are behind a circle. Fans. Competitions are started by young fighters, and adult wrestlers finish. And sometimes, because of the large number of participants, wrestling goes on even until late at night.